The Washington football team announced their official new name, and it is the Washington Commanders. Chase Young was on a video openly saying, nah, there ain't no way they're going to pick the Commanders. That's a terrible name. That's a shit-ass name. It is like, a shit-ass name. <laughs> out of all of the options that they had, how did we get here? How did we get to go? Because you already know what people are going to call them. It's going to be the commies. They're going to be like, the commies. <laughs> Every sports writer in the world is going to shorten this thing down. Okay? Yes. And you can't shorten it down to comms because that doesn't make any sense. Nope. I, I don't know what you would call it other than the commies. Uh, but outside of that, I have, what I would like to know is the process in which these names get chosen, right? Is it a point system? Does everybody there have a vote? Like, what are we, what are we looking for here? Because there were a ton of really good options, options. that they had, yep. and and this is the best they could do. So I don't know the answer to that. I will tell you that if I owned a team, I can only speak for how I would handle things. Okay, if I owned a team, if I owned a business, if I owned something, and we had to change our name for whatever reason, I would hire a bunch of smart marketing folks to help me. But at the end of the day, this is not a vote. This is not a democracy. This is my fucking team. I own it, okay? And I'm going to pick this name at the end of the day. And it all lands on me. I think this all lands on Dan. And I think this is one of those situations where I don't know how this guy made all his money, but I don't think he's very good at making decisions at all. I, I actually think he's really bad at it. Yeah. Uh, there's more allegations that came out on Thursday against him from uh, from former employees. So, And we won't get into those yet. We i got to sort through them and whatnot, but... It's another train wreck. I don't know. Obviously, I think we will eventually get used to this, the commanders. But, boy, this is something. This is it, certainly it, something. I saw somebody on Twitter. I wish I could remember who it was. I give them credit for it. But uh, they had, like, the W with the commander's towel or whatever. Yeah. And they said, you know, Steelers have a, a, a terrible towel. This is going to be called the calm rag. <laughs> And I thought, that's pretty good right there. Like, that's a pretty smart person right there. That that's is true. somebody that's pretty creative, because I wouldn't have thought of that. So, no. Man, I, I thought it, that was good. I like that. I, I, you know, if you're a, an NFC East team or somebody that likes to poke fun at the Washington football team, um, this gives you a great opportunity to do that. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.